While the whole world is fighting against the pandemic virus COVID-19, the skilled in Orissa professionals at Government ITI Katak in the state of Orissa have been busy developing safety equipment for the health workers who are acting as the soldiers in the war against COVID-19. The first innovation is a portable walk-in sample collection kiosk to help testing for coronavirus. This was first seen in South Korea. Inspired by this idea, a dedicated team of four skilled trainers from fitter, electrician, painting and carpentry trades developed this mobile chamber despite the lockdown. This kiosk is a mobile cubicle cabin with a sealed glass front that protects the pathologist from getting infected. It has extended gloves attached in the front through which the medical practitioner standing in the cubicle can collect samples safely. The entire structure is supported with wheels at the base for its mobility. Swab can be collected without direct exposure and contact. After swab collection, the gloves can be sanitized from outside. The second one is a service robot named Cobot which stands for Corona Combat Robot. SAC Robotics and trainers from Information Technology and System Maintenance and Electronics Trade came together to make this robot which has mobility enabled through wheels and has a humanoid structure. The hand-like structures can hold a tray and carry a load up to 20 kilograms. They can be used in COVID-19 hospitals to carry food, water and medicine to and from the patients. This will reduce the risks to the health of attendants serving the COVID-19 infected patients. The wireless communication protocols being used to control the robot can further be programmed with navigation and mapping to make them work autonomously a given ward in a hospital. The third one named Nigabot is a telepresence robot which can be used for surveillance and teleconsultation by doctors who can interact remotely with the patients through live video streaming. This robot is also enabled with a wheeled mobile platform and has an interactive device for video calling. This can be used by health workers who have to make several rounds to the patient's bedside for checkup and health monitoring. This will reduce the risk of human contamination of all kinds for the patient and protect the doctors and nurses from contracting the virus in such interactions. All these innovations would lead to reduced need for more personal protective equipment kits and could be a savior for the health workers. Dr. Rishikesh Mahanti, an alumnus of IIT Roorkee, heads this premier skill institution situated in the Silver City, Katak. Established in 1958, this ITI has grown from 11 trades and 200 students to 21 trades and 2,500 students. Recognized as a center of excellence in production and manufacturing sector by Government of India, the ITI offers industry module mapping with NCVT syllabus to make learners industry ready. It is an example of industry academia government tripartite partnership. The ITI has industry partnerships with corporates like Schneider Electric, SMC Pneumatic, Toyota, Honda, Maruti and Lincoln Electric. The work of finding innovative solutions to COVID-19 challenge was entrusted to the ITI by the Director of Directorate of Technical Education and Training, Regu G. We look forward to scaling up these innovations to positively impact the community at large.